Well, it's been brought to my attention that DSP Gaming is still out there. And the only way to stop a problem is to report a problem. Anytime you see DSP Gaming streaming on Twitch TV, if he violates the littlest rule on Twitch's terms of conditionings, you must report him to Twitch. This user will be held accountable for breaking the rules on Twitch TV. So if you're out there watching DSP Gaming and if you're over the age of 12, which is probably hard to find right now, because I realize that most of his subscribers or whatever that watch his content must be children because I can't imagine a grown man or an adult will watch Pikachu or whatever the fuck that is. But we must hold users accountable if they break the terms and conditioning on Twitch television. So if DSP Gaming is out there and he violates the littlest of rules, any infraction whatsoever, he must be reported Twitch TV must be notified and they will have to deal with it appropriately because we can no longer stand idly besides ourselves and watch this man continue to beg for money online when he is a 40 year old man who can get a job and do whatever it takes to maintain a plausible functioning society and viable society. He has a big condominium that he has bills and that does not require begging. You can get a second job. You could even get a main job and use Twitch as a platform to supplement your income, not beg for it. So if DSP Gaming commits the littlest infraction, and I don't care if it's a little one, he farts on Twitch television, and that's against the rules, then you must report him. We will not tolerate this. Now, by no means are we going to report a false infraction. These must be committed files and fractions against terms Twitch's rules. If he doesn't do anything, do not report him. These are only infractions that we report. We will not get no one banned for no reason. There must be a reason. And if he violates them, we have to hold him accountable and Twitch must hold him accountable. So Twitch, we're going to be policing your website to get rid of problems. And right now it's been brought to my attention that the DSP gaming could be a potential problem. Now I have to watch and see what this entails. I haven't watched anything from them. So if you have anybody else you want us to watch, let us know. We will keep a firm eye and try to make online a much more safer community for people out there.